Hello everybody, I'm meteorologist Jeremy Wheeler and we're doing a Wavy TV 10 virtual tour today. Today we're going to do a tour of behind the scenes of the Super Doppler 10 forecast. This is a seven day forecast. It looks pretty simple, but there's a lot that goes into it. And so what we're gonna do today is we're gonna take a look at that and how we build all our other forecasts. We're gonna look at some of the technology as well. So let's have a look. As soon as we get in, we start and hit the ground running. We've got a lot of things to do. There's a lot of work. So what do we do? Well, we start off by getting information. And so we use a whole bunch of different sites. This is a National Weather Service. That's one of the main sites that we get. Uh, this one, this is kind of interesting. This is um, a site that gives us a whole bunch of numbers. It's called the Model Output Statistics, the MOS. And so what that means is we take a look at the high temperatures, low temperatures from each model and the precip chances, and we put it together. And you'll notice that the numbers are usually not the same. So we got to try and use our experience, mine's 20 years, and try and figure out uh, which model's doing the best. Uh, we look at the models in map form, and so we take a look and see the forecast all the way up to several days out. And then we also have, uh, this is the Weather Prediction Center, they have fronts on there, and they help us out also with wintry weather and things like that. Now, we get all that information in, we build the forecast, I write a little bit out on the sheet, and then I do a little bit of radio cut, and then I come back and I start working on that seven day forecast. Now the seven day forecast, uh, it looks very simple, but there's actually a lot that goes into it. We have to choose not only the high and low numbers, but we choose the icons, we choose uh, the, the se secondary icons and all things like that, the rain chances. So we have to build that in the morning. And then we also build a bunch of different graphics. Uh, this one's the express forecast, for instance, and I put also the uh, high and low temperatures on there and the uh, rain uh, icons and the winds as well. Some graphics are automatic, some we build. So uh, again, there's a lot and there's several different blocks that we do. There's a, I've got three hits basically and I have to build all those and we actually build uh, some AR graphics as well. That's for later on in the shows. So then uh, we're building the shows, then we get ready to go. We got everything ready. Uh, we have to put our gear on. This is my earpiece, so the producer in the back can talk to me. We've got a microphone, and then uh, we gotta get ourselves ready too. So this is my makeup bag, and uh, it needs to be clean a little bit, but basically, yes, we do wear hair and makeup uh, for the shows. And then of course, my jacket. Now during the shows, we're also doing extra things like social media. So we've got uh, X up, and so I do a forecast for that. We've got Facebook, and that's another option. And then uh, later in the shows, I do a weather blog, and I try and put a lot of information in there in case people miss the forecast and want things more in depth. And so I go in here and add graphics and a whole bunch of text. And so if you ever want the, the real behind the scenes, what I'm thinking, this is it. And again, that's the weather blog that we do. So this is a little bit of behind the scenes. Uh, this is how we do the forecast. Again, there's a lot more work than you realize that goes into it, but we try really hard, the whole Super Doppel 10 weather team, and try and bring you a good forecast. I'm meteorologist Jeremy Wheeler.